Right after hitting the skids, 2012 was a huge comeback year for automakers, and they want to keep that momentum going. This week, they are showcasing their new models at the Detroit Auto Show. Our Sean O'Shea has spent the day at the show across from Windsor, and tonight he gives us an inside track on what's new. Good evening, Sean. Well, good evening, Anna Leslie. Detroit is seen as the number one auto show in the world because it is the showplace for auto manufacturers to show what they've got going. Just a few hours ago, auto journalists decided that the Cadillac ATS was North America's car of the year. It's been ranked the best General Motors Cadillac ATS, a $35,000 style setter. A big win for a company with some stiff competition. Uh, this win allows us to make the proof point that we're not playing for second or third, we're playing to win, creating the uh, best car in North America. The ATS has a feature called Q, Cadillac User Experience. Jenna from Cadillac shows me how changing a radio station has a unique feel. The added bonus in industry first is we have haptic feedback. So when you touch your screen, you'll feel a small vibration on your finger. You know that the system is responding to your command, so feel free to give that a shot there. Here in Detroit, car companies are marketing to the max. It's always something to look forward to, especially when there's a great concept car like we have here today. Toyota unveiled its concept Corolla Furia, trying to put some sizzle into a small size car. Canadians like sizzle, but typically buy small and sensible. We are a broad feature, but, but we, are, we are big in small cars. In Canada, we have the largest small car lineup in the industry, and we're going to continue to refresh and add to that moving forward. Many car makers are trying to refresh their car mix. Speaking of small, the Fiat 500 has added a slightly larger four-door model. Mini Cooper has added a sportier John Cooper Paceman. Porsche has tweaked its Panamera. Volvo has updated its lineup, while Volkswagen has shown off its first hybrid Jetta. The critical three words in the auto sector that uh, stimulate sales is product, product, and product. And what we're seeing in Detroit this year is a depth of product and a breadth of product that we've never seen before. The 2012 was a big year for auto manufacturers. It was the biggest year since the recession. But auto manufacturers are hoping that 2013 is going to be an even bigger year. They're trying to convince consumers that this is the year to get out of the car they've been hanging on to and get into something new. Anna Leslie, it's back to you. Thank you, Sean.